three diseases that could wipe out millions within the blink of an eye. How do we protect ourselves from such diseases, you may ask? That I can tell you in one word. Vaccines. Probably one of the most famous cases of vaccines throughout medical history is the great polio vaccine of the mid-1950s. To tell us more about this outbreak is an old guy that we picked up off the street not five minutes ago. I remember when I was a child, they said they came out with the polio vaccine. And I, of course, agreed because I'd rather be alive than in an island. <laughs> And so they lined us all up, and they gave us the injection, and they said, There you go. No more polio for you. But what does it all mean? To find out, I talked to a student from Hillsborough High, Howard Blair, and he told me everything I needed to know about vaccines. So, Mr. Blair, what exactly do you know about vaccines? Well, first roll was too hot for a thing to live on it. Then it cooled down a touch, and then some cells and things started to grow. We aren't talking about vaccines, aren't we? Oh, yeah. Well, a vaccine is when you take a dead virus and you inject it in somebody so that when they get infected with the real virus, their immune system knows how to get it. And then they don't have to worry about getting sick. And there you have it. That is the facts on vaccines. And now that you are armed with knowledge, you can go out into the world knowing that it is a safe place.